Okay, traders, uh, let's discuss. Uh, I'm done trading for the day, so let's discuss VRPX. If you recall, if you've seen my pre market uh, picks today, I did mention today that uh, VRPX is a candidate, and I did mention today that VRPX, which is kind of strange, you don't see me often do that. I mentioned it on the long side, I could have same way posted it on the short side because I did mention possibly short too. Did you ever see me do that? No, you've never seen me do that in 21 years. <laughs> never wrote something like that. Why? Because you don't always have something that looks as good as VRPX. And why does VRPX look so good for trading today? You have to start with the daily. Look at the daily. Several two days ago, not several days ago, it was at $4, 4 to $5. That's it. Yesterday, he decided to pop up to $19. You don't mess with a stock that goes up from $4 to $19. You mess with it after it moved up a day farther. Why? You know, the first move up, what happens? Everybody calling their friends and telling them, you remember the last time I told you you need to buy this or that stock and you didn't and I just made 10 grand on this stock and I told you you should buy and what happened to you and why didn't you buy and look at what happened. I told you VRPX is going to move higher because he did this and he did that and I don't care what he did. And then the friend thinks that for a day and then he buys on the second day. This is the day the friend buys. And when the friend buys, everybody's losing money because that's the rule in trading. The rule in trading is that the first who comes in makes money, the second pays the bill. <laughs> and that's how it goes. First one got in, second one pays the bill. So VRPX is moving up, moved up yesterday to $19, jump up today to $35. Today it's up 100%. But if you look at the previous day, it started at 4 or $5. So... Does, I mean, does, does, do we have stories like this? Well, yeah, we do have in fairy tales. And, well, fairy tales sometimes come true. But normally, when the stock comes up from $5 to $30, then everybody, say, no, everybody, most of the people will say it's just a matter of time. Now take a look at the intraday. That's the intraday in five-minute candles. I took the first short uh, somewhere over here during the first five minutes. Of course, you take a trade during that time, you take a big risk. I took the risk, I lost money. That was a losing trade for me. And uh, my second, uh, and I had another another trade, a winner in ZIM, which did not even cover uh, my loss in uh, VRPX. But I was waiting patiently. Why? Because I know that most likely a stock like that will come down at some point. So I'm looking for the point of reversal. The point of reversal has a lot of uh, indications. Well, not always. You look for a wide range candle, which is this red candle, but remember it was green at some time and uh, because it, it did move to a new high and you look for an extended volume. If you look down here carefully, you can see a very extended volume bar. And then when it started coming down, just under 33, I posted it for a short and I knew I'm going to have a three point stop loss. Therefore, my target should be another three point. Now, it started coming down. I saw the momentum. I kept adding. I think I added twice. I came up to quite a large size in this trade. Uh, you want to see the result? How much you're betting is my result? How much up am I after covering my loss? Because I had an initial loss. Just write down the number. What do you think I got there? Anyway, I'll show you soon. Anyway, fairy tales don't normally exist. A stock that is up 100%, a stock that started up, uh, moved up just two days ago for $5, 4 to $5 to $30, 30 sorry, $36, not likely to hang on. People will take profits because that's what people do. They do take profits. And it's the second wave of the people who bought it. The first wave could make money. The second wave being pushed in by other people is likely to lose money. Remember this rule as well. That's when the stock markets are crashing because everybody's coming in, because everybody's hearing what the friends did and how much money the friends made. So when everybody's talking about how much money they did, that's the point where, uh, <laughs> the sh sorry, shit hits the fan. But that's, that's what happens. And 
so when it started coming down i shorted it now i do know that many of you guys can short a stock like that because it was not shortable on regular stock trading platforms but i do trade colmex and colmex comes out with a fantastic idea of trading cfds contracts for difference which works exactly the same like stocks but actually with much more liquidity much smaller spreads i mean sorry the spread of the market was smaller slippage uh, unlimited liquidity so i could move moved in uh, with tens of thousands of stocks if I wanted and I could have shorted it without a slippage with large quantity actually the volume in VRPX is so high today so that you could have done the same with regular stock platform but you could short it because it's restricted and with a CFD platform it's not restricted and you have so many other advantages and I did post a link and there will be a link below this video which you can click and join Colmex or uh, if you can't trade Colmex because you are in the US or in other places there's plenty of other options like for Canadians who cannot join Colmex there's a way to join our funded account program the TradeNet uh, education program which also comes with a referral to a funded account this time it's uh, it's by TFS but you can trade a TFS funded account and do the same it's the same idea it's a CFD platform so please enjoy it so let's see the numbers here um, Simon saying 130 then 70 100 50,000 Joshua uh, fully saying 30k Ellen is very dangerous uh, generous 200k Errol is saying 280 and Ime saying 300k uh, what do you guys say in YouTube 700k no Adam saying 370 um, VJJ saying 5k maximum Eliron saying 40k 200k Damien <laughs> some of you guys were very close some of you guys were very close here's the results so VP VRPX I'm up $102,000 I should say this is a good day it is a good day this um, kind of things doesn't often happens it's quite rare to find a stock that behaves this way based on the daily remember based on the daily it always starts on the daily so it's a good day I was prepared I posted it pre-market time on our trading room which you can clearly join for free if you're on YouTube or uh, with our customers here on our live trading room and be prepared pick the right picks do the right thing and make money yeah and <laughs> and then you have probably the best world's best profession so again plenty of links right here below and um, also right now in the trading room and just enjoy your rest, the rest of your day thank you all for joining and if you haven't given us a, a like a thumb up on YouTube please give us a thumb up right now we will appreciate it it helps more people like you uh, join trade, day trading and learn a little bit more about trading and the more we are the stronger we are that's the rule see you tomorrow bye traders